Diesel, can you say good, say good morning, everyone? Good morning. <laughs> Mommy's blocking your light, though. We've just been laying on the floor while Mommy's been getting dressed and ready, and we're about to head downstairs and eat breakfast. Right? Right, the coolest brother? Yeah. Yes, we are. Hey, everyone. Good morning. I know we said good morning with Diesel upstairs, but we have come downstairs, um, and I just made breakfast. I am having... Uh, sorry, the sun is like beaming through that window. Two eggs, a piece of toast, an apple, and crystal light and water. And then this is Tabasco sauce I add to my eggs. And Mr. Diesel is over here. Yes, I know, you're not supposed to do it. But he is in his jumperoo. And there is TV on that he's watching. I know, he's under the two age limit for TV, but hey, we're a busy family. It keeps him, um, when I'm trying to like make breakfast, it works for him. And he also happens to be a younger sibling of two older girls that will have the TV on as well. And a dad that loves to watch TV as well. <laughs> so that's just how we roll in this family. Um, it's different when you have like, when you have an only child, it's much easier to enforce that no TV until two years old rule that pediatricians always tell you. And if, hey, if you can do it, more power to you. <laughs> it's just not, it's not in our daily routine, <laughs> having no TV. I would love to go like a week without TV. I bet you we would accomplish a lot more in our daily lives in this household. <laughs> so, but that's what we're doing. He just ate, um, I gave him just the Gerber, I think it's stage two, oatmeal with mixed fruit, fruit medley, that's what it was, oatmeal with fruit medley. Um, Gerber, baby food, so. He's doing good and I'm going to eat now while he's in his jumperoo and watching TV. <laughs> all right, we're all bundled up. It's a little after 10 o'clock and we are going to music class. It's not like a, it's actually over at one of my good friend's homes. She does in-home daycare for about, I think she has like six kids there. Um, and instead of her taking all of her daycare kids to like a music class um, activity, she actually pays a guy that comes and plays guitars and sings kids songs and all that fun stuff. And the kids go crazy for it and run around and dance. And Diesel loves going too. He likes watching all the other kids and stuff, but he is super tired right now. So we're gonna leave a little early and hopefully he naps in the car ride. That's, fingers crossed, we're hoping for that. We'll see, but I have him all bundled up in his hat and a blanket and all that good stuff. I don't have a coat on, supposedly you're not supposed to put coats on when they're in car seats. Um, in Wisconsin, you pretty much end up having to use, use a coat because if, especially once they get a little older, it's one thing if you carry the car seat in and out where you can buy those nice warm car seat covers. But if you are picking your child out of the car seat, when it's say 10 degrees out, you don't want to take them out without a coat on. I mean, I guess you could wrap them up with a blanket right away, but today is I think going to be a high in the lower 30s. So it is definitely chilly out. I am refusing to wear my winter coat yet. It's not even Thanksgiving. <laughs> so I'm refusing to put on my winter coat. So I just put this little like sweater, whatever it's called, cardigan? I don't know. Anyways, and we are heading out. Diesel fell asleep. We've left music class and now Diesel fell asleep in the van. So I drove through Arby's and got a salad. It's like, um, their farmhouse salad so it has it does have crispy chicken which isn't the greatest but it is delicious and it's a salad so it's good enough so I'm gonna eat this while he's taking a nap and then I probably can't see it out my window because it's super sunny out but I came into Madison to go to the mall I have I have to buy my girls snow boots and uh, um, snow pants hello my mind just went blank snow pants still um, Cause the snow has it was gonna it was supposed to snow on Monday but luckily it moved uh, north of us so we didn't get any snow where we live but I'm sure any day now it'll snow so I have to make sure they have the proper gear so that's what we're doing so I'm gonna go and enjoy my salad just 
got to the mall. I oh, should I do some I'm looking for snow pants and snow boots for the girls, but Mr. Diesel's asleep. We're having some success at the mall. Bought some more like fashion boots. Diesel's hanging in there with my shopping. We're going to Sears. I want to see if they have any Columbia jackets. Okay, we're back in the van, running all over the mall. It was so funny. I went to the children's place and I bought a purple coat. Like, because I looked at Jason Penny's and they had some, but none that I loved. And at children's place, they had like their coats 40% off. So this coat was like $41 it ended up being. Anyways, and then I go to Boston store and Boston store had Columbia coats so I bought each of the girls a Columbia coat hopefully they fit and they work definitely a little bit more expensive I th they're on sale as well they were like around $70 um, but they're just so much more I don't know they're just so nice like they're, they're not super thick and bulky um, but they still keep them nice and warm and stuff and then I found uh, snow pants which both the girls they want the overall the overall kind of snow pants um, versus just the kind that you wear more like on top like pants without the top part um, so I was having a hard time finding those as well but they had those uh, a brand Lon London Fog at Boston store as well for like 20 I think they were $27 each so I bought them each a pair of those so when we get home and the girls are home from school I will try them on and hopefully they fit and they work out okay but it was so funny like that stuff is like bulky so I had like these huge bags and I'm pushing just diesel in his stroller and stuff so but we survived we made it and then of course I come outside and there are flurries coming down so I guess I'm not getting this done too soon the girls will definitely need this stuff pretty soon so that was our adventure for for today oh I also wanted to show you um as I dip down <laughs> at music class the guy that does it um, has of course CDs as well so I bought a one of his CDs it's um, David Land Lando I think um, kids and kitties is the name of the CD that I bought so um, I'll I'll play it sometime for diesel but and the girls probably will like the songs as well I don't know they you know they've kind of moved beyond kids song they listen to the radio um, just like the latest pop songs like Katy Perry and all that good stuff so uh, okay I'm heading home we made it home we made it home in about 20 minutes or so the girls will be home um, gotta let Pinky in. there she is there she is there you are Pinky whoa slippery and she jumps and she jumps and she jumps and she jumps, and she jumps, and she jumps. <laughs> I know, I know. I'm just changing Diesel's diaper. I was gonna show you who was eating his foot. Are you, were you eating your sock? Were you eating your sock, huh? Yes, he was. He was eating, every time I come to change his diaper now, he puts his feet in his mouth. So funny, oh, there he goes. There he goes. Are you going to eat that whole foot? Is that whole foot going to end up in your mouth? It can't taste too good. <laughs> Above his changing table, I have this big letter D that I got at Pottery Barn. Anyways, and there's also... I wish it would have fit to cover these. The people that lived here before us did these um, screws with the, you know, like the big thing that you put in before the screw so it doesn't come out of the wall. <laughs> they must have shelves or some heavy picture here or something before. Um, so I have one on either side. So I have to take those out and figure it out and hopefully, I don't know. Like, we don't have this paint. This is the color of the walls were before we moved here. So, I don't know, we'll see. See if I can fix it. And I was thinking, well, maybe I could put like stars, like I bought like these wooden stars. Maybe I could like decorate somehow around the D or something. I don't know. I gotta figure it out though. Where are you going? 
Where are you going, huh, Diesel? Where are you going? <gasps> oh, boop. 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 Diesel, look who snuck up upstairs. Who's not supposed to be up here? Pinky's not supposed to be up here. I know. Say, so you're not supposed to be up here, doggy. Pinky. All right, come on. Get down. You know it. Get down. Downstairs. Okay, so I went down to the door. And who was there? Miss Samaya. And what did Samaya say to me? That I will have book club. Yep. I forgot about it. But luckily, Amara remembered. So, <laughs> so we hurried up and got Diesel ready and got him in the car. We jumped in the, the car and we came to school to pick up Amara from book club. And so. Diesel still wears his socks. Diesel still has his socks on, right? Yep. Yep. Not all right. How was school today, Smile? Good. It was good. And I got to read two for two hours for recess, and it wasn't even cold in the library. Awesome. Awesome. You guys didn't go outside for recess? Yeah, because I because the two hours is the full recess. Oh. Wonderful. Cool. <laughs> Those there. So we're actually here a couple minutes early, but I'm gonna head in and get Miss Amara. Look who's here. So how was school? How was school? Fabulous. Was it fabulous? Yeah. Yeah. What was the best part? Um. Uh. Snack. Snack. Snack was the best part. All right. Yeah. We're gonna try on the coats and snow pants, okay? Look at my mouth. Yeah. Oh, I'm sure everyone's happy to see your mouth. Thanks for sharing. <laughs> All right, we tried on coats. I'm a marshmallow. Amar and says she's a marshmallow. I'm a marshmallow. You're the marshmallow man? I'm a marshmallow. Hey, don't push. Amara, don't smile. I'm a marshmallow. Yeah, let me see. I'm a marshmallow. Scoot back so I can see all of it. I'm a marshmallow. The coat ended up being a little too long. I think the snow pants, they're just so I'm a bulky. Okay, we heard you, you're a marshmallow. So my eyes fit actually really well. Hey everyone, it's almost bedtime for the girls actually. Um, we just had dinner and I came in, changed Diesel's diaper and put him in his pajamas. Like it's a little reindeer pajamas. Yep, we're busting out the Christmas stuff already. See what he's doing again? I told you every time I bring him up on this changing table, it's so funny. Hey everyone, it's um... I don't know, about 9.30. All the kids are asleep now. Diesel actually went to sleep already. And I am going to turn off the TV and go to sleep myself. Hopefully Diesel will sleep through the night. Please, fingers crossed, please sleep through the night. I want a night's sleep straight through. Um, we'll see how that goes, though. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this vlog. And please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe. Um, and we'll see you later. Bye.